I would definitely have applied to get into here whether I got in or not was a, was a different matter. Engineering was something I was always quite interested in. I grew up on a farm up north. I always found myself messing around with machinery and helping my dad repair things. So when I went to university, mechanical engineering seemed like the degree that I'd be most interested in. The ultimate goal of education is to apply our theoretical knowledge in uh, real life practices. This was just an opportunity to showcase just that. So I started the day in a group of the students and we were designing a wind turbine. Have these angled, beautiful spinning motion. It will lift anything you want off the floor there. I'm being carried by these two here. <laughs> and if it goes wrong, you can just blame me. <laughs> It was surprisingly good. He came with brilliant ideas about the number of blades that we need to make in order to increase the power to be generated by the wind turbine. We had a lecture, quite interesting to look at all the aerodynamics in a rugby ball, things that I've obviously got an interest in but I've never crossed them over in my rugby and my engineering, so it was interesting to see that, that there is that transfer. He actually shared some brilliant ideas about how we can apply mechanical engineering into rugby sport. He shared his own experience with us. From just being here for the day, you, you see how many different aspects of engineering there are to go into each product. And just from going around the labs, I've, I've seen how vigorously the testing is on sort of every aspect, from acoustics to, to practicality. And, and like us at training, we, we're going to make mistakes as we push boundaries in, in training, but we're trying to perfect ourselves, so we're putting the best version of ourselves out on a match day. I think the Dyson Institute is such a a unique opportunity for people to come and, and do a few days of the theory and the lecture learning and then be able to transfer it into the workplace <laughs> working with Dyson so you're sort of getting the best of both worlds and it's a really good group to go now. Right so thank you very much for letting me come in and get a little taste of what you guys get up to. It's been a great day so thank you. Here you go. <laughs>